Shukam our viewers, we are now in Lengisho near Bisil. Near Bisil Center. Town, yes. Uh, just along Namanga Road. Eh? Mm -hmm. Joining to Tanzania. Yes. Uh, Kajabe County. So in water drilling, we've got the main three phases. Mm. One is the drilling. Yes. Two is the pump solution. Mm. Then three is water tower and the tank mm. solution. Mm. About the and under the drilling stage one. The survey, we, we do the survey on groundwork mm -hmm. uh, and also we come up with the report, the, the hydrological survey, the environmental report for the purpose of uh, the permits mm -hmm. to clear with the government uh, authorities. Um, then after that we do the mobilization of machineries. Uh, then we do the bowl setting, mm -hmm. we start the drilling. Mm -hmm. In that drilling, we drill as we detect the soil sampling. Mm -hmm. When we drill after every three meters, mm -hmm. we take some sampling which is assigned mm -hmm. to get yeah. some information. Mm -hmm. So the drill should be very, uh, should be very careful okay. in drilling, mm -hmm. because uh, for us, for this report, just to give him some overview about information. Mm -hmm. Then during that drilling, also we can do, he will detect where casing mm -hmm. can be installed. Okay. And if necessary or not necessary, clay soil where you must do the casing. Mm. Casing is where you, you insert the big pipes, mm. the steel mm. pipes, eh, mm. to stabilize the bore, mm. not to mm. collapse. Mm. Yes. Mm. Um, we also do flushing and cleaning mm. that bore. Mm. We seal that bore mm. so that uh, anyone should not temper. Mm. That's now under phase one. Okay. Mm. okay. Yes. We charge differently mm. from the area. And the soil formation. Mm -hmm. For example, mm -hmm. we as a company we have different packages mm -hmm. and we also work with the how someone or a client can afford. Mm -hmm. um, the next phase or the next stage about the drilling is pump installation. Pump installation. Pump installation. Okay. Now if you look at this area, we don't have the electricity. Mm -hmm. So here it means we shall use the solar mm -hmm. energy, the pump. Mm -hmm. okay. Pumps are the same. Mm. The only thing we put a gadget either to use the solar or the electricity. Mm. So here we shall use the solar. Mm. So we ca I cannot say how many solar panels mm. or how many watts mm. until we do the borehole. Mm -hmm. Then from the borehole, it the, 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 the way the the kind of that borehole and the content of water inside, it will give us which kind of uh, pump we should use on that borehole. Mm -hmm. And that pump will give us the what how many the, the currency the soil if i say soil insulation i mean the motor mm -hmm. the submersible motor mm -hmm. the submersible pump mm -hmm. uh, the submersible cables mm -hmm. the underground cable mm -hmm. uh, we also have the hybrid inverter mm -hmm. we also have the surge arrester that uh, prevents the lightning oh, yes okay. we also have um, uh, 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 float switch where it detects mm. if the level of of a borehole is below mm. the pump automatically stops and on that tower is where we put that switch mm. up there around more than 16 15 feet mm. to avoid some safety okay uh, yes okay yes the tank here mm. you need a tank of more than 10,000 liters mm. Uh, 10,000 and, and above mm. so that it can uh, sustain to activate the four acres. Yes. We got to understand very well mm. that your, 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 this thing we are doing it in three phases yes. the drilling phase, the pump phase, and the tower phase. Yes. Does this place look like there is water for a long time, or do boreholes have problems in the future? With the uh, does the water reduce, does the water add, or does, can the water disappear at some point? Uh, it's a good question. Mm. Water drilling is very is very technical. For us, this gadget is just to detect one, two, three. Mm -hmm. But it doesn't mean that that's 100%, 100% sure. Mm -hmm. okay. There are some doubts in okay. those these machines. Okay. Two, mm -hmm. when you drill water, mm -hmm. you find that uh, water, mm -hmm. then you get water at 120 meters. Mm -hmm. For example, the 120 meters can give you around two cubic or three cubic. Mm -hmm. Then you say, no, let me proceed mm -hmm. by drilling. Yes. If you go deeper, mm. you can get more water, <coughs> but with more minerals that are not good for human. Okay. Mm -hmm. 
the water that we shall get first, we shall we start detecting. Mm. Okay, there's that surface water, that rain water, mm. above 60 meters. Okay. 60 meters is around 120, it's around 180 feet. 180 feet yes. Yes. From there now, mm. we start detecting which kind of water is mm. and how efficient it is. Yeah. How efficient. Exactly. Yeah. Okay. If we found that this water mm. is good for human beings and it's sufficient, somehow it can fill the tank thrice yes. in a day. Yes. We can deal with that water at that moment. Instead of going deeper mm -hmm. for us to extract the minerals that are not useful to human beings. Okay. Okay. I've understood. That, that understood. Although other people interpret that the more deeper you go, mm -hmm. the, the more, more water you water. get. It's not uh, mostly that way. Yeah. Because uh, uh, when the, 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 how water behaves yes. is very mysterious. Because uh, we, 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 there's, what, there's what is called as streams. Streams are those pointing of water. Mm. Just stream like these rivers. Yes. The streams. The, 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 the one on yes. above, above. So there are, there are those ground. there are those streams eh, mm. coming. They come and join yes. the streams. Eh. Uh -huh. The converging point. Mm. The stream from this from this side. The meeting the, point. The, the yeah. meeting point. Yeah. So from that stream, mm. the, from that converging point, mm. it forms what is known as uh, uh, the water table. Okay. okay. Are getting? Yes. The water table. Yes. And that water table is now forms that it forms aquifer. Which a is? Aquifer. Mm -hmm. Aquifer is uh, a place where water comes from. So aquifer is where water table the water table is as is Joining. joined both, uh, together okay. and it has stored water. Okay. Now these aquifers they vary according to the, the rock. Mm -hmm. Drilling mm -hmm. yes. generally they charge per meter. Mm -hmm. So where problem comes in is this. Somebody will come here, will target the drilling up to 250 meters. Mm -hmm. Because the more but money it is. The more money it is. Because mm. the more he drill, mm. the more money he charges. Yes, because so his point is to get out from here, but he has two million in the pocket. Mm. Mm. That's the drilling only. Mm. Has made most boreholes to go not in a way that is recommended. The outcome is not good. Mm. Okay. Because uh, our aim to come here mm. is for us to be water. That's true. Sufficient mm. and pure mm. or, or recommended for human mm. consumption. consumption. Not the depth. Yeah. So that most companies they charge per depth. Mm. And that per depth is where where you find that maybe you they charge five thousand five hundred per meter mm. or six hundred it depends. Yes, but yes. at the end, mm. the more the deeper it goes, the more the more money you, you find that that bowl is salty. Salty. Because he got water at 90 meters, mm -hmm. which is which is clean. Mm -hmm. He left that. He went deeper, deeper. up to 250. 200. Now it's salty, mm -hmm. and that's why if you walk around Kitengela, Kajiado County, mm -hmm. where you mm -hmm. find these tanks mm -hmm. smeared with whitish. Yes, salty. Even I'll show you one here. Yeah. These communities mm -hmm. have seen whitish. Okay, those the, are the minerals <coughs> you are talking that about. That is the salt. The metallic tank or. No, that plastic tank, that black plastic tank. Mm. You find, you find, see, it has been smeared by some white, whitish, yes, yes, oh. yeah. like a chalk. Yes. Okay. Yeah. That chalk, that color, that whitish, it is salt. Those, I get it. Those are the minerals you are talking yeah, about. I'm talking about. Yeah, uh, excess minerals that were not needed. That's the salt, compassion. and that salt is excessive yeah. for human. Yeah. Uh, I get it. Uh, Why he drill, he was drilling depth. Mm. He was not drilling water for human. Yeah. <laughs> Yes, perception. That point. Have you have, have, yes. have you seen that point? We've understood. So, yeah. uh, on camera, move the camera. Mm. I am. We are advising mm -hmm. other companies not to drill water per meter. They should focus on drilling, uh, focusing and targeting uh, water that is uh, sufficient and suitable for human being. Because drilling per meter, they take advantage of that because uh, they go deeper, mm. charging higher. And you find that instead of they have got water at 90, for example, mm. they go on up to 180, 250, that is much contaminated, contaminated with the minerals mm. that are not. If, if I may say something there, yes. that's one of the reasons that I finding out how a customer can pay. Mm -hmm. One, two, you are not going for the meters because every place you talk to anybody that is doing uh, boreholes, they will tell you 
uh, it's actually 5,500 to 7,500. So then, and the, the, the other question is, they will tell you yes. until we find out how many meters, we cannot tell you, we cannot be sure. And that is one. And the other thing they also tell you is that we will not, um, we will keep doing because the deeper you go, is the more water that comes, just as you have seen. Yes. It looks like probably for these reasons, them they are looking for the, their pocket money. But I liked your company for the fact you said when we get the right water, yes. we will stop there. It doesn't matter how many meters. Uh, well, let me. It is true what you have said yes. because you have given your own explanation. Yes. Your 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 aim is not to go how deep mm. it is, but how to access right sufficient water, water yes. isn't it? Yes. If you also meet somebody that only digs based on the depth, they will also explain to you why they do that. Mm. Isn't it? Yes. How sufficient will we say that this water is sufficient? Different places eh, have got different soil formations. And this formation of soil, they give us different water content. Why is it you have choose this point, not here? Because this point can give me around more than 10,000 liters in a day. This point can give me, but it can stray. Mm -hmm. Where maybe dry season, it may not give me. So, my sufficiency is this point now. Mm -hmm. I'm likely choosing this point than this one. So, this one depends on the soil formation. There's no guarantee that you'll get water two cubic, one cubic, three cubic, five cubic, whichever. As we drill from zero point to the last point of the depth, the drilling, the drilling, the driller or the operator of machine should be detecting carefully the flow and water, the, the content of water that's coming out of the it, We can be able to tell. We can be able to tell when we reach another another layer of the soil, we can be able to tell this, this layer is either fluoride mm -hmm. or uh, mm -hmm. magnesium. Look at central province mostly. You find that the individuals there are with brown teeth. Tree teeth. Fluoride. Fluoride. Yeah. I'm getting. Yeah. The fluoride comes from water. Mm. Yes. And that's what. So there are things that we need to observe. Mm. Yes, we are trying to get sufficient and good water for human consumption, mm. but let it be sufficient because this is uh, somebody's sweat. Let us target his her interest first mm. before we put the community again. Mm. Uh, we, 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 our work is to advise that uh, if this is around 10 acres, let us focus to get water that can run for more than 10 acres and, and, and above by serving, her, serving the gland first before we can do that to the community. So if I can give you even 10,000 liters recommended water compared to if I can give you 30,000 liters every day, you treat it using 200,000 pension. So which one can you choose with both? The less. So sufficient comes in. Mm. Is this water sufficient, sufficient to your consumption? is to enable to get water that will sustain you and your business here. Mm -hmm. So I'll try to estimate this water, is it suitable for you to sustain your business and your home here? Mm -hmm. That's my target. Mm -hmm. Before I put other interests. Okay, what you're trying to say is that we might want more water to share with the community, yes. but it might be a bit a bit tricky. A bit tricky. Because uh, maybe the water content is that we are we are trying to get before once we, we do the the ball drilling, we do the test the, 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 the test pumping. Mm -hmm. Test pumping will give us a report that this water okay. discharge is where the ball the rate that the ball is being filled with water. How long does it take for water to recharge mm -hmm. that ball? Mm -hmm. I get it. Yes. How long does it take? So that's called the discharge rate. There are some boreholes where if you try to pump that water out within a few seconds, the water is filled in. Okay. That's the soil formation about that place. Don't blame the driller. There are other places where if you pump that water out, all of it, it will take you like, like one hour 
for the ball to get recharged. Hmm? One hour plus. It's not that the ball is dry, no. no. That's the formation of the, soil. of the that soil. It takes a bit one hour. Mm -hmm. You waiting for the that that the to, for the ball to be recharged again. Yes, drilling is expensive. Mm -hmm. We agree. But uh, <coughs> also as a company, Kenya Houses Investment Company. We have tried to talk to our clients mm. and they have given us advices on how we can make arrangement on paper mm. so that it ca comes as somehow affordable yes. to anyone mm, that is willing that is willing to mm. have the water. Whole, like, the whole. Water drilling is uh, an area where you can't tell. You, we are not guessing, but mm. you cannot tell mm. because we're dealing with the nature. So it's not seen. Mm. It's, it's not like construction. Because yeah. when you do construction, you, you are constructing something that you are seeing. Mm. When you put the foundation mm. on the house, you are mm. seeing. Mm. When the house is, is falling down, you are seeing. Mm. But now with the drilling, it's difficult. Underground. It's underground things. Mm. So we use gadgets. We use gadgets, the PQWT machine. We use a terameter. We use the satellite. We use the <coughs> pool and mm. other things. Mm. To, there are so many, many, so many, many ways to get water point. Mm. Let me bring you closer now. Yes. If you take the coconut, put on your palm, <coughs> that stand, the coconut stand, move it here. The coconut will behave mystically and it will stand. Mm. Yes. It will stand here. If it stands, it means that there's water here. Yeah. <coughs> oh. Take the egg from the indigenous hen. What is the indigenous hen? Kenyaji. Yes. <laughs> indigenous hen. Mm. Put it on the palm. Move it around. If there's a place where this egg will sense and will stand. Really? Yes, at an angle. It means there's water there. Wow. Yes. Take two wires. This side and this side of copper. Two wires of copper. Mm. Move them this way. <coughs> yes. If you reach a point, it they, it will cross this way. Yeah, they'll bend. They'll bend. Each other. Really? Yes. They'll cross. Uh, it means there's water there. Uh, so those are the traditional methods of finding, finding water. water. But now this one, they'll not tell you how deep it is. Yeah. So we go advanced. Oh. Like using the parameter, yeah. using the 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 the, the peak depth, using the satellites and others to detect somehow the depth. <coughs> when you start drilling. Yes, you have just pointed that there's water there, mm -hmm. but exactly you don't know what yeah. depth you are going to. Mm -hmm. Even for our, even if I tell you that we shall go to 50 meters or 150 meters, mm -hmm. it's just so important, so much important because the most important that you have pointed there, the water point. Mm -hmm. So the, during the drilling now, it's when we want to deal with the, something at hand. Mm -hmm. let, let us go up to 60, we see how it mm -hmm. is. Let us go up to 80, we see how it is. Mm -hmm. So we start detecting. And the type of the soil formation is mm -hmm. there. Mm -hmm. Then after around after 60 meters, you stop the machine. Mm -hmm. Get some lunch, get a break. After one hour, go back to the machine, flush it, you see water pulling out. A lot of water. So it is tell you that this bowl it has water. The recharge is, 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 is slow. The recharge is slow, slowly. I get it? Yeah. Um, when you're drilling, once we hit water mm -hmm. that is required, yes. It's recommended that to stop there. And this water, when we somehow, ob from the observation, we see the water is sufficient yes. and somehow pure, mm. somehow, somehow good for human consumption, we stop there. Then we bring in the pump to do the testing. We pump out this water mm. to see this borehole can discharge women liters. Mm. It's called test pumping. Okay. Are you getting? Mm. From the depth of the borehole, mm. already we have taken the point that this borehole is this. The depth only will give us the the pump. Mm -hmm. There are different types of pumps? Yes. Okay. That's suitable for that depth, mm. number one. Mm. Number two, the co water content, even if you flash with the, during the drilling, mm. it will give us which kind of the pump will direct us, which kind of the pump, mm -hmm. of how many kilowatts. Okay. I get it. Mm -hmm. Now, once you take this much the motor and this much <coughs> the pump mm. you fix together mm -hmm. the kilowatts are indicated there that mm. this pump needs these kilowatts mm. 
energy, mm -hmm. then you need to combine the solar panels that will give you these kilowatts. Okay. I get it. So it's the pump, it's from the borehole that will give you the pump. Mm -hmm. Now from the pump, it will give you the how many panels? of the solar. Mm. Are you getting? Mm. Now when it comes to the panels, mm. we have the small, big, medium panels. Mm. Starting from, but mostly we use 280, 275, 260 watts, 275. Mm -hmm. The number may be depending on the, mm. the arrangement mm. and the necessity of the pump that is required. Mm -hmm. okay. For now I cannot tell how many panels. Mm. I can say it's between 8 to 12. <coughs> Until I set water and we start surveying here. Mm. It's the condition of the land that gave us mm. that because this this the road mm -hmm. this is somehow bushy, mm. it is sloppy, mm -hmm. you can start surveying here. Mm. So it's the condition of the land. We were not we were not planning in our mind that we are coming to survey to mm. survey here because the land is big. Mm. Why don't we go there? Mm. It's because the nature and the condition of the of the land that has given us that that thing that, so same to drilling so when you drill when you drill you drill at what point that is the the flow after drilling that water the bowl will give you the which kind of the pump now the pump will give you which kind of the panels how many panels and which kind right okay yes so of solar yes will the price change or where the price can change, eh? yeah. when when we do the estimations, yeah. we figure out between eight to, to twelve. And we as a company, we also have a guarantee period mm -hmm. because if we install the panel, we install the pump, we must monitor the flow of, the, of that the running of that pump. Okay. Mm -hmm. If there is any problem within the, within sixty months, mm -hmm. within six months or one year, mm -hmm. it's for our company to come and rectify. Mm -hmm. I get it. These are the machines. They need maintenance. Mm. They need training. Mm. You need to train the client on how you will be operating on and off about the okay. These are the imported machines. Mm. The pump, the mm. panels and whatever. Mm. So you need to be close to the client. Mm. Your advice. And if there is any problem, go back to the site, go back to the borehole and rectify mm. one, two, three things. Yes. 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 How, may, how long does it take to, to, mm. for an entire project? Yes. Mm. Now, I've said, uh, water drilling uh, is divided into major three phases. Phase one is the drilling. Mm -hmm. Phase two is the pump installation or pump equipping. Phase, phase three is uh, tower fabrication and tank installation. Now let me start with phase one. Drilling, phase one, that is phase one, it involves a lot. Mm -hmm. One is preliminary. That is the compliance, or I can say it involves a surveying, hydrological survey, environmental report, giving a government permits. Mm -hmm. yeah, so those are the called they called comp the compliance documentation or the necessities. Mm. Then under drilling also phase one, we also have got mobilization of the personnel and the machineries. Uh, so we we have we have a challenge in in Kenya. Uh, I'm free to say so. Uh, to get the permits from the relevant government authorities takes time. Mm -hmm. Yes, okay. it is so. There's so it's so much process. Okay. Because uh, once you get the comes to the site to get the data, mm -hmm. you make the report. Mm -hmm. The report is done by the the licensed hydrological surveyor. Um, but in Kenya, we sh we have a problem with the time yeah. because it's not a one day event. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Even if you launch for application by the to the to the authority, it takes somehow long until you follow. That's the challenge that we have. Mm. If I'm appealing the government of Kenya, uh, like um, the examination of the of the of the second school and the primary school were, were taking around nine, uh, were taking around. Uh, Three months mm. be marked, mm. Mm. but when the Honorable Matian came in, mm -hmm. <laughs> the exams were marked within one week, two weeks. Yes. So yeah. the same same concept should be applied to these compliances. Yes, yes. Mm. because water is a necessity. Yes. Because according to the law, you must comply with the government 
before you start drilling. Before you start drilling. Yes, yeah. that's the thing. Yeah. But now it it is forcing other people to drill, mm. then to start getting the permits later mm. because okay. it takes time. Mm. Mm. So I cannot I can't tell how long it will take to get permits mm -hmm. because. Uh, it can take from one day to even 90 days or, or more than that. Mm. Because we have got different government authorities, authorities there. Yeah. Mm. That's number one. Number two, mm. uh, in the event the machine, the drilling machine is in good condition. Mm. And the access is also good for the machineries to come to the site. Mm -hmm. Then I can say in less than one week or in less than two weeks, mm -hmm. The bowl will have completed. Okay. Yes. In fact, mm. two weeks is, 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 is too long. Mm. But uh, I can let me just put it two weeks because mm. we have got yes. that. We have got uh, these are machines. You yes. never know. Mm -hmm. uh, but in less than two weeks. But mo other mo most people we drill within three days, two days, three days mm -hmm. to do the drilling, to do the casing, mm -hmm. and everything. Mm -hmm. okay. Yes. Okay. But now, why it takes two weeks, mm -hmm. not three days? Because if you do the drilling, there is a place where you drill. Then you stop to install the surface casing. Okay. What is a surface casing? A borehole must be cased, and casing is different types. So surface casing, uh, according to the soil formation, once once you start the drilling, that is the soft soil. Mm -hmm. Before you hit the hard soil, mm. the hard layer. Mm. The, so this soft soil must be surface cased. Okay. okay. The bowl must be surface mm. cased. Mm. To stabilize, I get it. Mm -hmm. The other part can remain without casing, casing. or can be cased okay. um, as per the soil observations. Mm -hmm. I get it. Yes, sir. And uh, if the gland is existing to case fully, then he can pay for that if he has paid for that. Mm -hmm. But uh, we we do casing where necessary. Depending. Yeah, there is that moram soil, mm -hmm. there is rocky soil mm -hmm. where you do the, the surface casing. Mm -hmm. But there's some places the soil formation is clay soil up to the end. It's soft. Oh, okay. That one you do cast casing from the top up to the, the bottom. The bottom. Okay. There are, there are, the, we have the PVC casing mm. and the steel casing. The PVC casing is used for those bowls that are less than 80 meters. Okay. Uh, but uh, a borehole which is more than 80 meters, you must use the steel yeah, casing. Okay. Um, so. Uh, I think I've answered about the drilling. Yes. I, can, I can say it takes three days to two weeks to, to do weeks. the drilling. Yes, okay. If you have the mm. the compliance from the government. Then. Mm. Now pump pump solution. The pump it takes one day. Mm. Still the pump. Okay. Yes, take one day. At most two days. Okay. Yes. Uh, but also when you install the pump, you need to run that pump to test that borehole mm. and also to flush that water. Yes. Remember when you drill the borehole, the residue. Mm. From that bowl is that 